Bernard Pivak, the immediate past president of the Queen Anne's County Historical Society. And we would like to invite and inform everyone that we have a wonderful exhibit here uh, at Tucker House and at Wright's Chance uh, through the third Thursday in January. The exhibit is the Heartland Quilts of the Eastern Shore. And we've been very fortunate to have Miss Kay Butler and Miss Kathy Spence share with us their personal quilts. Some of these quilts are from the 1800s and they're in amazing shape. For example, this quilt, the Double Heart or St. Valentine's Patch Quilt, is between 1850 and 1860. There are 36 alternating squares of red and green cut work cards. It's a very beautiful and well-maintained quilt. There's a great opportunity coming up on December 21st to visit us with our speakers, Kathy Spence and Kay Butler from the Heartland Quilters of the Eastern Shore. And that's here at Wright's Chance, 6 to 8 p.m. on December 21st. If you would like to join us either the first Saturday of January, that's January uh, 6, from 10 to 2, or January January 18th from 6 to 8 p.m. We would love to uh, see you. Please feel free to text me at 443-994-7505 if you'd like a private tour or you have a group that would like to come in. Or if you just need information, please visit the Queen Anne's County Historical Society on Facebook. This quilt here is a crazy quilt that was given to us by Mary Ann Massey of Y Mills, who is a descendant of Colonel James Rowe from the War of 1812. Crazy quilts were just beautiful patchworks of all the different pieces of fabric that were around the house at the time. This is a beautiful exhibit with close to 60 quilts that will amaze you each and every one that you see. We look forward to seeing you here at the Queen Anne's County Historical Society for our beautiful exhibit, The Heartland Quilt of the Eastern Shore. Mm -hmm.